Hello YouTube and welcome to another Linux tutorial. So in this video I will show you how to hide actually files and images in Linux. So already let's get started. So in this video actually I will not be using any third party software in order to hide files and images but we'll just use actually the command line. So first thing first, we have here, as you can see inside a directory here called test. I have here the image and here there is a folder and inside this folder, I can put the files or the secret files I want to hide inside the image. So here, for example, in the secret folder, as you can see here, I have just put a secret text file containing some text. So the text here, this is a secret message, okay? So how can I actually hide the secret folder which contains a secret file inside this image without using any third party language or third party software? So the first thing to do is to compress actually the secret folder. So I will just right click on this folder and I will hit compress. Here we go. And of course here I will stick with the default compress format which is .zip. So I will create it. Here we go. So now I have actually here created a zip file which has the same name as my folder and it contains a folder which contains the secret file. So now I will go to my terminal. Okay. So as you can see here, if I list the files, so there is the flower.jpg file, which is our image, and of course the folder and the compressed version of that folder. So in order actually to hide this zip file inside the image file, I will use a cat command. So cat is by default in any distribution of Linux, so you will get it by default and simply I will provide the name of the file which is flower.jpg and also the zip file which is secret.zip and I will put that using the superior sign in the output file so I can name it whatever I want so for example I will name it image dot jpeg okay here we go so if i list now the contain of this directory you can see that another file has been created called image dot jpeg so now let's move on actually to our folder okay here we go you can see i can actually delete all this zip file and secret file or folder okay here we go and also I can delete my former image which is flower.jpg so now I have only the image that I have created which is image.jpg but we know that we have embedded actually a folder so how can we extract actually the container or the folder name secret from this image so it's pretty simple. I will go once again to this test directory. Here we go. Let's see the context. So I have only the image. So simply to extract the directory and the file inside this directory, I will use unzip command, which is also by default in my system. And I will provide the name of the image which is image.jpg here we go so now you can see that we have extracted this directory so if i do a list you can see that i have back the secret file so let's go to the explorer and see if actually i get the secret file so this is the directory that we have extracted and inside it we have actually our secret file so let's click on it 
and here we go you can see that I have back my secret file so it's pretty simple process you don't need any any third-party software okay and of course if you have multiple files you can also do the same process okay so if I paste let's say that we have a bunch of files you can do the same process all you have to do is to go your terminal and use your cat method so cat the name uh, the name of your image file okay so this is the syntax image file then the folder that zip which contains all your secret file and you output that to any output image you want so the same the process is pretty simple as that so with this simple command you can actually compress your whole folder which contains actually the secret files and of course don't forget to compress it using zip or you can use just here the right click and hit the compress and of course we'll choose the zip file okay so remember to do that every time you want to hide some secret file inside an image and of course to get back your images you use the unzip command followed by actually the image file okay it's this is just simple as that okay so that was just a brief uh, video to show you how you hide files inside other files as always i hope it has been informative for you and i want to thank you for viewing bye bye